Hey up, I'm Alex, I'm the Night Digi Destined, and this is Florence enjoying some crisps. So we're out for a bit of a mooch today, and I don't know, inspiration just hit. I've got some Digimon with me, so uh, let's mooch. So this is a Digimon original version one, who's currently a grey mom. I hatched this out with Hayden, and uh, we did an honesty run, so all our battles were only against each other. And uh, turns out, Greymon is the victor. So he, Hayden raised an Ogremon. Greymon is at 59%, which by my calculations means Ogremon's at 41%, which means Greymon is the champion. Yeah, you off to. And this is Hayden's Ogremon. I've somehow ended up fostering it. Don't really know how that's happened, but whatever. So Hayden raised his Ogremon and dumped him on my doorstep and ran. <laughs> so uh, let's clean him up and let's have a quick look at him. Ogamon's freaking ace though, it? Look how cool it is. 40%. So there's a 1% kind of difference somewhere, but I don't know. I don't know maths. There's Ogamon having a little picnic with Flozza. Ace. Then next up in the team, we've got Deathmon. Now, I absolutely adore Deathmon's sprite. His name is Deathmon. He is the eye of death, but he just looks like such a cute chubby bunny. Check this out. Let's clean him up. Look how cute he is. Hey, let's give him a belly rub. <laughs> it wouldn't end well, but you know, I would die trying. On the vital bracelet, I've raised Vidramon. I've fired up the Ancient Warriors dim because I've currently completed all the current BE memories so I've just gone back to some of the old dims again and Ancient Warriors is still one of the best and I've just got such a love for Vidramon at the minute so yeah raise the Vidramon and I'm just working my way through adventure mission with him pretty cool and ladies and gentlemen the moment you've all been waiting for the Digimon Color version DD09 who's it gonna be bam 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 Metal Greymon and this guy digivolved from Vidramon and it was particularly cool to have Vidramon on a Digimon original brick because it was very much like the origin story of V-Tamer where a tamer is raising a, a regular old Digimon version one and somehow ends up with a Vidramon even though Vidramon's not on the device. It results in him being transported to the digital world and it's freaking ace. And he digivolved into Metal Greymon. Look at this absolute unit. The original badass from version one. That'd make a good song. Lol, laugh, 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 laugh. So let's check out Metal Greymon in action. Let's go to stage five. Up against Dark Tyranimon X. Definitely one of the best looking sprites in here. I think Ray absolutely smashed that one out of the park. Looks freaking awesome. Can't wait to raise a Dark Tyranimon X. I love the X antibody geezer firing the X fire blast thing. Looks sick. There's our Giga Blast. It's just blast, blast, blast. Oh, Tyranimon right, X is kicking ass. There we go. That was a good fight. So yeah, this vlog isn't something I particularly planned or anything. It was just out and about and just inspiration hit. And it hit for a few reasons. First and foremost being, I started re-watching all of Chillin' with Kaku Joe's old videos again last night. And it just hit so hard as to like how far Digimon has come over the last 
six years or so. It's freaking ace and Chilling with Kakujo is still one of my absolute favorite Digimon channels of all time. Another reason I think inspiration has just slapped me in the face today is because I've just filmed my first episode of a whole new series with the Digimon Professor. I think by the time this video comes out, that video will already be out. So I don't think it's any particular spoilers, uh, but it's a new series I'm calling Finding Digimon. And it's just kind of chatting with other Digimon tamers and stuff about their experiences with Digimon. And I'm just feeling really excited about it. You know, I feel like it's nice to start like a new chapter, something a little bit different. So yeah, pretty exciting times. But as a result, I've not brought any of my usual like other Digimon props for, you know, the nature shots and stuff. Just got my V-Pets, just got Flozza and uh, the power of my imagination. So no pack of the day this time, just chin wagging and wandering. Cool. I don't even have my tripod with me, so we're going to have to do this kind of awkwardly. Greymon versus Ogremon. Can this work one handed? Oh yeah, not the ninth Digi Destin for nothing. Here we go, so Hayden's Ogremon versus my Greymon. Greymon has the current uh, lead with the victory percentages and all that, but it's any Mon's game. Also, how cool was the Greymon and Ogremon fight in the Digimon Adventure reboot? Freaking ace, horn is pride. Uh, Greymon wins again, but they both take an injury, but they're both pretty old now. Um, I think today's their last chance to Digivolve. They're both 10 now as of today. So I feel like this next 24 hours is their final call for Digivolution. So we'll see. Hayden's Vipa has this little um, deadline of pixels. It fixes when you squeeze it. So yes, before you start, I have opened it up and tried to tighten up all the screws and they're as tight as they can go without like snapping something. So there's probably a little bit of pressure loss somewhere else, but such is the nature of such old devices. This was made back in 97 or 98. So, uh, you know, gotta be a bit understanding. Epic. And uh, Florence is collecting up some dirt and some stones in a crisp packet. And I'd like to know what V-Pets you're currently raising as well. I hope you're raising some. You better be. <laughs> you don't always need a breeze. You don't always need a group patch, whatever. What do you think, Florence? A few more little life updates. So my knee, yeah, the cruciate ligament, it doesn't heal itself. So I am waiting surgery for them to hopefully repair it. But the muscle in my leg is feeling a lot stronger now. Like I'm walking with much less of a waddle now, which is good. Quick Florence check. Come on, baby. So yeah, I'm a bit more stable on my feet now, which is good. Uh, so I am trying to walk a bit more, just exercise to keep building that muscle up because apparently the muscle needs to be strong before they can do the surgery. And I don't want any delays in the surgery because it's already been forever. But it has been nice to kind of take that step back, you know, every cloud has a silver lining and all that. And it's been nice to be able to just kind of take that step back <laughs> for the sake of repeating myself. But yeah, it's all right. I'm feeling, I'm feeling better about it as well. I just really hope I do get the surgery because it seems like it's a bit of a lottery as to whether you get the surgery or not. And even though, yeah, my leg's feeling quite a bit stronger now, I don't want it in the back of my mind that if I turn wrong, twist wrong, or put too much pressure on it, that it's just gonna give way and I'm gonna come crashing down in a heap. So yeah, that's that. Cool. Oh, it's nearly battle time with Vidramon. Let's do the mash. We did the monster mash, the monster mash. It was a giga blast, the digi mash. It happened in a flash, the digi mash, the digital monster mash. Oh, it is digi monster mash time. Flame drum art, the fire of courage. V Nova blast. Oh yeah, straight off with a critical, no messing about. Uh oh. Flame drum dodged it. Here we go with fire rocket, right in the face. Come on, here we go. Oh no, it's not looking good. Hang in there, buddy, hang in there. Oh man. We're about to get roasted. Well, bloody hell. Bloody hell. Poor Vidramon, I'm sorry, bro. All right, let me know in the comments what style of video you want me to prioritize which doesn't necessarily mean it's gonna be my next upload but the one that you want to see soonest do you want to see another me versus you video a series where i take acom ba battle challenges from my viewers or do you want to see another cards cans and questions video so let me know in the comments below do you want me versus you 
or cards, cans and questions. Cool. Look at that grubby face. <laughs> You've eaten a good lot of mud today, baby. <laughs> you grubby pop. Look at you. Remember that vlog I did a while back? I think it was called the DigiWorlds Burning. Well, that was actually right here. And it's all completely healed. So yeah, remember that, everything heals. Well, thanks for joining me on this little mini digi vlog, this little chin wagon wander video. It's been really nice to get out and get some exercise. We've had some Digimon battles. Florence has eaten her own body weight in crisps and mud. So uh, everyone's happy, everything's good. So I hope you're all having an ace day, whatever it is you're doing. Stay true to the digi destined in your heart. And uh, yeah, I'll see you in the next one. Stay safe, stay ace. Keep rocking. Peace. You say bye. You say bye. <laughs> Yo, little bit of bonus content because I got home and the postman was here. So, my Digi Battle collection. So, I've completed booster set one and two. Um, I've completed the movie promos. The last thing I have to complete on my objective is the serial promos. And I'm very, very close to it. Uh, one of the ones I'm missing is this one, which, ladies and gentlemen, has just arrived today. Serial promo, Metal Seedramon number 26. Because it's a shiny one, it's been so insanely hard to find. I've never even really seen it for sale, so I don't really know what it's even worth. Um, this one's in really good condition as well, so I'm absolutely buzzing. So now I've got that. There's just two left to complete this. I just need Piedmon, serial promo version and Joe a serial promo version and then that'll be my serial promos complete and that'll be my current digi battle com objectives complete so yeah it's an exciting day for the collection buzzing <laughs>